yes, we have a WrestleCrate. Now, let's just start with this is not the monthly WrestleCrate. No, this is a second chance WrestleCrate. Now, they had a special offer just before I went away for price reduction on buying second chance things and anything in there. Store bit. So I got this crate. I'm going to have to put down the bottom how much I paid for it because I don't remember now because it's been like two, almost three weeks since I physically ordered it. That it's nearly due for that real wrestle crate to turn up for this month, which I think is probably being posted out probably as this goes up. So you might see another wrestle crate video straight after this one. But this one of their second chance ones. Now, what's normally in the second chance one is nothing to do with what's in their monthly one. Now, let's just correct this. It is what's in their monthly one, just not a specific month. This is technically overstock. This is whatever they've got left from a number of the boxes after they've sent out some, what they've got left that they had too much of. So what is in this box matches no month that anyone has actually got. So this is not like this is a second chance to get January's box or December's box. Whatever was in them two boxes is not what's going to be in this box here. This box is a mixture of different months going back I don't know how far. But unless you can see each item and know what month they actually turned up in, it will be a real thing. So some of this stuff could be from a year ago and some of it could be a couple of months ago. So let's get opening it. Now, as I say, I've cut this bit away just to save time and save have a knifey in my hand. So I'll open the box and we'll see what we have. Now, I won't be doing the speed version of this one since it's straight opening of a thing. Now, I can feel the t-shirt. So let's start with, I think it's the pin. Which I'm throwing around, but... <laughs> okay, so we'll start with the pin. Let's try this again. It's not easy to hold this, you know, but... So, as you see, it's uh, Tony Storm. Now, sure, this was quite a few months ago that this actually turned up. I haven't had it in any of my boxes. It was before I actually joined. So, the pin, they must have a lot of them. Because they've been quite there quite some time. And I think they were actually up on the store. And so, therefore, they haven't been selling off there. Right, what else? Okay, we have the sticker. I'm wondering if this has come off one of their t-shirts in the past, because most of the stickers seem to be, by the time you get them, linked to a t-shirt that has been done either the month before. So that's the sticker. We, of course, have our free access card turnbuckle tv so it's www.turnbuckletv.com stroke wrestlecreate to give free access for the first month stand at those piles of them out there so therefore you can use that code everyone can use it it won't make any difference what i have is a group of a number of postcards i'll just get them all so they're actually in the same direction now i could have trouble identifying some of these wrestlers just because of what they're wearing and that they might be in promotions that i don't physically watch so, first card, 
It is a WrestleCreate exclusive. And this one's two of four. Kenny versus Kota. Is that? Don't know how you pronounce that. That's two of four. So this one's one of four. So since it's got the Chinese writing, it has to be New Japan, doesn't it? Um, and that one, that one's three or four, and that's the last one. So that one was four or four. So four postcards, sized pictures of the same wrestling event. It actually doesn't say when or what event it was linked to on the back, which it could have, because that would give us a bit more information. It should really have said this was this event on this date from this wrestling promotion and that would give us a bit more information of the meaning of it because was he doing it because it was a championship belt since he has a championship belt in that picture was this one of a big event that he was going with it don't know so a bit more information on the back of it since it's a postcard had plenty of space to print more details now what else have we got now don't forget also in the in this box you do not get what you normally get I've got still to hand is one of these you don't get a list of what is in the box on a bit of paper like this simply because it is not bulkable for that type of thing because if you take it they're doing probably hundreds how many wrestle crates they physically do a month now i think i will keep the picture to last but i have a dvd which i'm not sure if i have already got because i have one like this um but this is chaos dvd it's got Will Ospreay in it. So, I'm sure I have a Kios one. So, I could end up with two videos exactly the same. That is the downside to the Second Chance crates, is that you will get stuff which, if you've been collecting for a while, will be repeat items of what you've already got. Now, I'm going to leave the same picture because I know it's there and go to the t-shirt okay so we're gonna to go to the t-shirt now now the t-shirt is the flip Gordon one now as you take it or if you don't already know I have opened the monthly create with a flip Gordon in so this is a second Flip Gordon t-shirt that I have. So since I am keeping one in good plastic condition, I can therefore open one and wear it because I already have it. So keeping one good and in collector type state, good for me. But since I have already got this, I don't really want two of them in collect a bit so therefore i will wear that ah you might see his wear it opening a wrestle now as i said coming in this box oh i have a poster as well if you take it there is more items in this second chance box than what normally comes in the standard five monthly one because i have the pin I have the sticker, I have the cards, I have the t-shirt, that's four. 
this poster which I can't tell if that's the right way up I'm looking at it from behind seen through below so that's the poster Riptide now I think that came out quite some time ago but that's item 5 and the signed print big shock <laughs> there is a big shock coming for what the por the signed portal is because it is one I have but not out of a wrestle crate can we guess yet so before I show you try guessing about this picture I bought this one from someone off eBay it was to prove a fact that you can't price the photos that come in the any of the wrestling boxes because they don't run easily to value so what picture do I have and yes I have it so am I disappointed with it uh, no but I don't know it could no you couldn't have seen it but although I can with the light I can see through the thing it's Paul London which now means I have two signed Paul London prints so what am I going to do with it well nothing it'll just go into the collection as is it's an autographed image and whether I have one or two of it um, to me doesn't make a heap of the difference so that will go into my signed collection and join the rest of it because there is no point selling it as we said if I bought it for the price I bought it for, which I can't remember if it was £1 or £3, if I bought it for that price then I would have to sell that at that price and that's not worth a problem right now. I might as well keep it and keep two in the best condition. Now, there is nothing else left in the box. All empty. I am collecting a lot of these WrestleClear boxes. Um, I have a small pile of them now from, from each of the things but they are good strong boxes which can be used if you've got anything that takes up that much space for other things so that was my items so quickly to go through we have Tony Storm pin we have the sticker which I know nothing about I have the four cards we have the DVD the Flip Gordon t-shirt the poster and the signed Paul London image now that is more than what would turn up in a standard wrestle crate but I actually paid less for this than my standard including that it was delivered as well so am I happy with that yeah fine there's nothing wrong with it you know it was cheaper which is good it has six item in which is good because that's a good number which if you look, probably look at the price of the box itself probably I think may have come in at 12 somewhere around that would technically mean two quid an item so that's fine with me they're worth that much um was there anything else i would have liked maybe a different dvd because i might have had that one <laughs> but more information on the back of the postcards for event not just the name of who's doing it there's plenty of room on the back of there to fit more information so, that is opening a second chance crate and seeing that you end up with a bit more in it than a standard one. So, for now, that until we get our monthly crate, which is due really soon, is it for now. And I will see you. Please like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you on the next show. Bye for now.